also is a, uh, an event that uh, Owen Reed Simmons, uh, we dedicated to a uh, beautiful little boy last year, and each year we'll dedicate uh, this celebration and this Christmas tree lighting uh, to him and his family. And I know his, I know his mom and dad are here, as well as uh, his uh, grandparents, and we want to thank the Simmons family for being here and express just uh, tremendous gratitude for all they do uh, in the city with public service uh, from the family. So I want to thank them very much. Happy to see them here tonight. This is live TV. Go ahead. Oh, that's very nice. Now I have something for you. Wait a minute. I have something for you then. This is a city pin. I want you to take that. Thank you very much. And that's a great job. Thank you. Save that, okay? Thank you very much. This is something that uh, we all have to remember. The holidays are a very special time in our city uh, and for all of our families. And whether you celebrate Christmas, Merry Christmas, Feliz Navidad, whether you celebrate Hanukkah, which starts tomorrow night, Happy Hanukkah, whether you celebrate Kwanzaa, Happy Kwanzaa, or whether you celebrate Three Kings Day, Happy Three Kings Day. We all come together around our families, our kids. Uh, we all love being part of this community. It is a very, very diverse, very, very dynamic community because of all the different people who have come from all over the world and make New Bedford a tremendous place, a tremendous city uh, to live and, uh, and go to school in. Now, one of the things that we've done over the past, uh, over the past three weeks now is acknowledge the different public servants who are here to bring their wishes. And tonight, I'm bringing wishes on behalf of the city for everyone's continued happiness, health, happy new year, and I look forward to seeing you all on New Year's Eve at City Hall. We'll have an open house at City Hall, then at 9 o'clock, fireworks. It's a city celebrate put on by AHA, so it should be a great event. And then we're going to have both downtown, the north end, as well as the south end, will be open to entertain everyone through the new year. Uh, but the fireworks are at 9, get home, put the kids to bed, enjoy the New Year's Eve at home. The other thing that I think is very important that I tell you is that our city council president, Brian Gomes, called me just a few minutes ago. And he's unable to be here tonight, but Brian and many of the councilors have been at just about every tree lighting. The message that Brian has had throughout this holiday season is that we all look out for each other, that we all put uh, the love that we have for our families into our neighbors and our neighborhoods, and that we make sure that we uh, give anything we can for people less fortunate. For the, for the kids, for the families, for the parents, seniors, vets, anything we can do, whether it's putting a little bit of money in a church uh, basket or, or a, uh, a contribution box, or if it's an extra can of soup at the grocery store, making sure a neighbor gets it, or if it's just donating our time, or just a smile, a hello, uh, not only now but throughout the season. And I know that's been President uh, Brian Gomes' message. In addition, I want to tell you that we have with us tonight Dr. John Fletcher. Dr. Fletcher is a member of the school committee and has served with me through my uh, entire six years. I want to uh, welcome him tonight to uh, Owen Simmons' uh, Christmas tree lighting and uh, ask John to say a few words to everyone. Boys and girls, thank let's all say thank you to Mayor Lang because he's been an excellent, excellent mayor for the past six years, right? Yeah. I've enjoyed very much serving with the mayor on the school committee. We've had some real exciting times. But you know what, boys and girls? Tonight I know that you have Santa Claus here. You have Mr. Santa Claus here. And I know you're all very anxious to talk to them because Christmas is coming fast, right? And I see, I see you all many, many times at the Hathaway School and at other schools throughout the city. And I know Santa. I know that they've all been very, very good this past year, right? Especially these two little kids in the front. <laughs> so in conclusion, in blessed memory of Owen Simmons, which we're gathered here this evening, and to everyone, I want to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. I'm your neighbor. I live over on Park Street. This is my neighborhood. So I'm very, very happy to be here with you all tonight and have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas. 
Three Kings Day, uh, Happy Hanukkah, and um, Happy New Year. Thank you very much. Now I have representing Representative Tony Cabral, Al Madera's here to bring out Representative Cabral's uh, wishes. Hello everyone, how are you? Hello, I want to thank all of you for being here today. You know, on behalf of Representative Cabral, myself, in our office, I'd like to uh, wish you all a Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year. I also wanted to take this time to uh, thank Mayor Lang, who, uh, you know, Rep Representative Cabral, myself, and our staff consider him not only a mayor, but our friend. He's going to be a hard act to follow. He's a high bar. And uh, I just wanted to, uh, uh, I wanted to personally convey that on behalf okay. of myself. Okay, so again, have a happy, safe uh, Christmas and a, a wonderful, safe New Year. Bye-bye. All right, now, just a couple of things. Un unsung heroes who have gone out throughout the city, making sure that our Christmas trees are ready for these great, uh, these great lightings. All the city crews, I want to thank them. All of our city employees who do such a great job. I want to thank... Mark Mahoney, who's here tonight on emergency uh, preparedness, and all of his team who's here providing the lights, everything that we, uh, we need in order to have a great celebration. The hot chocolate, the crew comes in with gifts for the kids. We really appreciate it. Now, the other thing is, Vogue is, has come up with the hot cocoa. Thank you. And then, Santa and Mrs. Claus. Now, you can go to, uh, you can go to a, uh, a shopping center, a mall, you can see Santa and Mrs. Claus, and I know that's important. But we have Santa and Mrs. Claus coming to each of our neighborhoods to meet our kids. And, it's, and there's no doubt about it. You pull on Santa's wig, uh, his uh, beard, that's not coming off. That's not a wig. That's a real beard. You can see this is the real Santa and Mrs. Claus. They land at the airport because they don't have clearance at this point with the reindeer around this, uh, the roofs. They're brought in by emergency preparedness. They come to see all of you. Ask Santa and Mrs. Claus for whatever you're hoping for on Christmas. Tell them you've been good. Make sure that they understand that you're doing your homework, that you're working hard in school, that you obey uh, everyone who loves you, your families, and they will. I'm sure they will come on Christmas Day. Now, one last thing before we do that. We have to light the tree. In order to light the tree, only, okay, we're, we're going to have, we're going to, are they going to come up? Yeah. Simmons family is going to come up, lead us in the countdown. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas. That's a beautiful tree. Listen up. If you have ornaments you'd like to put on a tree, you can. Mr. and Mrs. Claus is all set to see everybody. So let's get down and party now. Hot cocoa and music.
offer up this night, Lord God, to you, and we ask, Lord God, that you would keep all of our children safe, Lord God, whether in schools, in and out, and on vacations, oh God. We thank you for the family members here, Lord God, those that are here to gather with us, and those that are in the neighborhood and the communities, oh God. You are doing a mighty thing, Lord Jesus, and we thank you. We thank you for our mayor and the politicians that have come, Lord God, and those that stand on the side of us, oh Lord God. We thank you, Father God, that the Holy Spirit would just guide this holiday, Lord God, and keep everyone safe. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Amen.